Hi, this is Gary with MacMost Now and another Macworld Expo special. On this episode, let's take a look at a really cool and really tiny projector. It's called the Show WX Pico Projector from Microvision and it's really tiny. It's about the size of an iPod or iPhone. And you can hook it up to your iPod or iPhone and project video onto a wall nearby. It uses lasers, that's right, lasers to project the image and it auto focuses on whatever you're projecting it on. So it's super cool and I caught up with Matthew from Microvision at the expo and he told me all about it. Hi guys, this is Matthew Parmeen from Microvision. I'm the product manager for, uh, we think, a very cool device uh, for, for a lot of other cool devices such as iPods and iPhones out there. Here, what I'm showing is our Show WX Pico Projector. This is a laser based Pico Projector. Microvision has created this specifically for mobile devices. What we're looking at right now is just the Show WX connected via a cable to an iPod Nano. So I'll go ahead and start this, show what some video looks like. So what you're looking at is kind of in a home environment, a, a projection image that can go from anywhere from 20 inches up to 100 inches. Now 100 inches is only in a dark environment so this is not going to replace any big projector anytime soon, but it's going to be a projector that you really can't actually put inside your pocket. And then you can also pull it out very quickly anywhere such as a Starbucks, your home, your friend's home, your parents, your, your family quickly connect it to an iPod or an iPhone and it's very similar in size to the iPhone. So now it's not only mobile, it's very portable to show information in a bigger screen size. So right now this is not yet available in the market. We're targeting middle of this year 2009. The price we're targeting is in the four to five hundred dollar price range. It's going to depend a little bit on the availability of some of the other configurations we're looking at. To get more information please visit us at microvision.com we have a VIP program started so you can sign up to be the first to know when you can buy this. Yeah, well, um, can you just quickly give uh, give some more examples of like different ways people might use this? Like in the Starbucks example, you know, like, yeah, just, okay. you, you probably have something in mind. Oh yes, okay. oh yes. So one of the cool things about this product is, you know, every one of us has a camera. It's in our phones, we have a digital still camera, we have a HD camera we're walking around with. One of the challenges is though we have a small display that we try to share that information on. So for example, if I have, I have vacation pictures from my Costa Rica trip on my iPhone, the hard part is actually sharing it to other people. So usually it's a, here, take a look at this picture. I don't know what you're looking at, but that's me somewhere in there. But what if we could now have, I can hold it and I can project it to three, four, five different people at the same time and not fear the risk of here taking and dropping it. So one of the wonderful applications certainly is to also show video too. So we got a bunch of video from iTunes, but now it's always trapped on my small little display. Now you can go over to a friend and say, let's watch a music video, let's watch a TV show, let's watch a movie. Uh, we spend a lot of money on, on all of our content. Now you can actually have a, a much bigger screen experience with all this content. So one of the cool things that we always do is, you know, envision you're in bed, you turn all the lights off, and just before you fall asleep, you project a 100-inch image up on your ceiling and watch a TV show. Not very many TVs are, are mounted on ceilings that I've seen, but now you can actually technically have a TV up on your, up on your ceiling. Cool. So one of the very cool things too of our technology is it allows an infinite focus. So this is the fiddle free functionality. So as I just come in closer, it always stays in focus. I never have to adjust any of that focus. Now that's inherent to our technology. Because we use lasers, yes, lasers, it actually allows you to just move back and create a bigger image. Fiddle free is what we kind of talk about. I don't want to. I don't ever want to look at an unfocused image. So now all I can do is just move it back, and I got a clean, sharp image. You can find out more at microvision.com. Till next time, this is Gary Rosenzweig with MacMost Now.